torrential rain greeted Wasps at Copfall Stadium as they sought to rock the Allianz Premier 15's boat by defeating the two-time champions in their own backyard. These London rivals were each without their influential Red Roses, who had travelled to France on international duty. But Saracens showcased their depth with a compelling first-half performance. Cat Evans bursting through the Wasps line with just two minutes played before Holly Aitchison, pulling the strings, orchestrated a similarly punchy score by Georgia Evans. The Welsh international surging onto a flat, hard pass and over the whitewash. The next beneficiary of Aitchison's passing masterclass was Deborah Fleming, who received a delayed floating ball on the wing to capitalise on a sizeable overlap. 19-3, with just 17 minutes played. The scoring baton was soon returned to the Saracens forwards as Rocky Clark, up against her former side, powered through the beleaguered opposition to secure Saracens their fifth bonus point in as many matches. Aitchison added the extras on an afternoon where she slotted four of five conversions before masterminding the host's next score. Exploiting a clustered Wasps defence and spotting Chantal Miel in space. Half time and a ruthless Saracens leading 33 to 3. Wasps returned to the pitch a different side entirely. Their newfound aggression epitomised in Claire Malloy's 39th minute score. The open side barrelled her way over the line and set the tone for the rest of the half. Facing a Wasp scrum on the five metre line, the hosts' pack almost muscled their way out of trouble only for England lock Rowena Burnfield to show quick thinking and even quicker feet, charging down the attempted clearance and clamping down on the loose ball to score. She added her second just minutes later, combining with skipper Kate Alder to overpower Saracen's defensive efforts. All the momentum was with the now swarming Wasps and Sammy Graham on her first appearance of the season, sniped from the base of a ruck to opportunistically bag their try bonus point. Flo Williams slotted the conversion to bring the visitors within a converted score of what would have been an extraordinary comeback. Saracens weathered the black and gold storm for a fraught final few minutes before kicking the ball out of play to maintain their unblemished record in pursuit of a third title. Wasps, who had won the second half 24-0, were able to take home two hard-won points from a truly nail-biting tussle.